Okay, today I'm going to tie a fly that's called an electric lemon. I found out last year that this fly is an absolute must in your box. I'm tying it on a number 16. That's a 2X Sierra hook. I'm using a tungsten bead, which is a 564th. It's an easy fly to tie and so effective. First thing I'm going to do is put some gills on it. Slide the bead back. For this I'm going to use white thread. And because it's a 16, my gill is going to be a little sparse. When I tie it a little bigger, 14s, then I'll uh, put a little thicker gill. All right, I'm using a very fine strand of gill material. What I do is I just bring my thread to the top, grab both ends like that couple of wraps on the front so that the eye doesn't or the bead doesn't slide over the eye. Now I'm going to run my thread down the shank and give myself a half hitch here. All right. Slide that back on there. Now I'm going to use, it's called a light olive. The light olive green. And this one is by Superfly. It's a beautiful color. I'll tie that on behind the Indeed, like that. Now I'm going to take my. I want you to take a look at this. I take both strands and pull them to the side. Whenever you pump a coronamid, the gills you'll see are on the. They have a tendency to flow to the side. There. That's all that's necessary for the gill. Now, I'm going to tie in a, a piece of wire. It's hot yellow wire. It's very important. If you don't have the hot yellow wire, then you can use a bright yellow thread double it up and then you can spin it for your rib. This is going to be the rib. Very important that you get a bright yellow. All right. Tie that in. At the same time now I'm going to take a piece of anti-static that I've trimmed. I cut this off a bag, very thin. You don't want a wide strand. Tie that in. There we 
go. Now I'm going to run that all the way down to the bend of the hook. Right to there. Come all the way back up. I'm going to give myself a very small gradual taper here at the top end. Now I'm going to cut my thread off. Give myself a couple of half hitches. The reason I'm cutting the thread off, I'm going to change colors. I find it important to have your thorax. I like to use a rusty brown for the thorax. Give myself a half hitch here. Now, run this up the shank, spiral it up. This is going to give it a nice gassy looking green. Give myself another half hitch here. And I'll bring the thread or the rib up. I like to use my hackle pliers. For me, it gives me better control. Gradual spirals up. Now I'm going to propel her that. Nice close crop. Like so. Tighten up my thread. Now build up your thorax or your wing case here. Like so. Next, I take my Loctite. Some people use a UV resin. I like to use Loctite super glue. Put 
I'm going to do here, take my dubbing needle and just kind of lift the excess off, like so. And that is called an electric lemon. I find it's probably one of my best flies. Hope you enjoy it.